So, so the thing is what I love about your work is that you tend to have a way of trying to take our subject matter and bring more into it. And yet sometimes just it by itself can be extraordinary. A lot of times what I find that people mask themselves in other conversations and other ways to cover things where they feel uncomfortable with. And so what I would like to see when I give a homework assignment out, and we talked about this a little bit with Marilyn last week, is that you don't need to come in and invent something. We love it when you do because you show us what artists do. And so it's awesome to see that moment where there's that excitement where you get to see you know, something being created. But the reason why I have people paint just a glass of water is I want to see how they paint. And if you paint it just absolutely something exquisite. Some of the water bottles that were done last week, they were exquisite. And I said, imagine them gigantic. And it's just a blown up water bottle, but you're looking at something and you're rendering it. That's the practice. You know, the story part of it is the artistic part of it, and I like that too. And I like to be able to combine them, which you do because that gives us an opportunity to see another voice. But I also want to see what you're looking at. Yeah. Um, here, is, where's your central focal point? Exactly. When I go, usually you're like, where's your central focal point? I want to have everybody say, well, it's right there. But you hear, <laughs> so the neck, no, it's like, and I want to hear you jump up and go, it's, you know, own it. Like, okay, so where's your central focal point? Don't look at your well, pain. I'm still processing what you said. I know. <laughs> As an art piece, it has a lot of statement and it's, it's, it's worthy of doing. As a homework assignment, I'm still always looking to see whether or not you have a central focal point, whether or not you have eye magnets, whether it's composed well. Okay. But I, I feel at this point in the art that I'm doing that I need to have some kind of a the, the lesson at hand. I, I, I feel like that's all I've ever done is listen to a teacher and do what he mm -hmm. expects. I, well, it's a lesson. And sure it is. I've been a good girl and I've done it. Mm -hmm. I sort of feel like I need to take another step. Exactly. And, and the thing is, as a coach, what I do is I step back and let you have that. Okay. Okay. But there's still some rules that I want you to always ask yourself. Yeah. And the thing is, you can always use the word choice. See, you could say, I chose not to put a center focal point in. And, and, well, then you would, uh, well, but the thing is, then we would have a dialogue and then I would say, why? And then you would tell me, and then you would tell me, because I want to step further. I just don't want to paint what's there. I want to develop my story. And I go, good for you. That's why I always ask people, so what were you thinking? You know, I don't care what you do. I don't know you that well. I'm oh, you know me as much as everybody else in this room. You paint it black, I'll tell you it's white. If it's yes. white, I'll tell you you should have painted black. Yes. Um, you know, the thing is, we, there's, no, there's no growth in agreement, right? So I will always, like, sit and try to have you. And the thing is, what I admire is if you take a stand like you did. It's like, this is why I did this. And I go, good for you. That's why I want to own it. Own it. You did it. You created it. And, and you could have had more light hit the bottle in one spot than the other. And you could have still worked within the, the confines of what I request, and st and, but still have the elements that I'm looking for. Because ultimately, what will make your painting superior is having a central focal point, eye magnets, composition. All that stuff counts, no matter how abstract you go. You can glaze it, you can glaze it, you can repaint it, you can do anything. It's just the bones at the beginning. But God, if I didn't ask you to do it, we wouldn't even have this. That's not the case, and you did a great job. Now what? Take it to the next level. <laughs>